Now we have been warning you about those fake glasses pretty much all week and tonight health reporter Stephanie Stahl is again explaining the potential danger and how to tell the difference between safe and fake. The problem is that you can't tell by looking at them necessarily. Rick Feinberg with the American Astronomical Society says the fake eclipse glasses can have official looking seals and numbers, but there are a few ways to tell the difference. The lens part of certified glasses have a shiny metal looking coating on the outside. The fakes can be black on both sides. They might be letting tons of infrared and ultraviolet through. And those could be frying your retina or frying your eyeball. That's where the damage occurs, right in the center of the vision. And if you're looking with both eyes, it'll occur in both eyes, which is, which is a big problem. Dr. Jack Dugan with Will's Eye Hospital says staring at the sun without proper filtration, even when it's partially obscured during an eclipse, can cause vision loss. The high energy uh, gets focused in the retina and it causes inflammation, edema. Um, it's actually called an oxidative process where you create free radicals that, that, that damage surrounding tissue. NASA sending the alert about fake glasses says another way to tell the difference is you can't see anything when you wear the real ones except the sun. Put them over the LED, you see nothing. Now we'll take ones from an unknown vendor, we put them over the LED, you can see the LED lights. So this is immediate indication that these glasses are not safe. Now, it's also important that the lenses are not scratched or damaged in any way. That could increase the risk for injury. Doctors say wearing certified glasses is the only safe way to look at the sun to watch the eclipse. But if people are having trouble or worried about these glasses, you can always watch on TV. We're yeah. going to have plenty of safe coverage for you. That's true. Make it easy on ourselves. All right, Steph, thank uh -huh. you.